Hello, hello, and welcome to Coffee Craft. I am your more than moderately scattered host, Anon Jr., and we are up at the Piglin Farm where I've been doing a little bit of fit and finish type stuff and uh, and adding a little bit. So let's let's do the fit and finish first um, because I need to. <laughs> well. For one thing, I, I went ahead and labeled all the items so I could more easily find out what I needed to fix if I needed to fix something. And that was immensely helpful. I also fixed the filtering problem because I can't remember if it was mentioned in the side channel or during the stream itself, but uh, after an AFK session, somebody had... Uh, accidentally broken all the the filters on this half and those filters were set up the same way so I wanted to look into it and the mistake was mine uh, basically to, to get these filters to work you need some number of filter items in the last four storage slots and some other number in the far left of the item that you want to be able to filter through and the idea is that you want the, the total redstone power to be enough that one more item pushes the power level up to three, which will unlock the hopper, drop the item through, etc., etc., etc. In order to keep this on the left a smaller, more easy to obtain number, I increased the number of filler items on the right. The problem with that is. When this tops out at a full stack, whatever that may be for the item, the combination of a full stack plus what I had in for filters meant that this signal was actually powerful enough to uh, move over one more block and power its neighboring block, causing this filter to drain out until it was empty. So... In order, if you don't want that to happen when you're doing your filter, one item in each of the last four slots and 41 items of the one you want to filter, as opposed to six in each of those four slots and 21 in the far left. Uh, that's great when you don't have a lot of stuff, but uh, and so look, in the beginning it was perfectly acceptable to do that perfectly reasonable to do that but now that we got enough items uh, yeah definitely definitely uh, top, top that baby up and uh, get rid of your extra filter items so that when it overflows not if but when it overflows uh, it doesn't break and so I did that for uh, all the filters on the gold farm side where we're getting the gold and the rotten flesh and I did it for all the filters on the Piglin Trading Farm side. So that way we get uh, all that squared away too. And that's just, you know, one of the uh, one of the one of the small changes that took a lot of time. You know, especially since after I saw that I'd done that, I wanted to take a look at all the other farms that we had filtering stations on and make sure that they were set up. So I went through the storage hall, fixed my mistake on each of the uh, bulk storage in the storage hall. I went to the witch farm uh, and fixed that uh, asterisk. I didn't have 41 items of each there, so I just set it up so it'll fill up to 41 and then everything will work from there. I meant to AFK uh, last night, but then I realized the server wouldn't be able to do some of its uh, pre-stream maintenance. So uh, I, I did not AFK last night. And I believe Arcadius and Rayest should be joining us pretty soon. Oh, I'm here. Oh, there we are. Okay. <laughs> Didn't want to interrupt your uh, monologuing. Yeah. I got caught monologuing again. Uh, just like a good villain. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I've also done a little bit of cleanup here. Put a roof up on there. Ooh, I forgot to lock that item frame. Don't, don't want... You know what? Uh, here's my uh, toolbox. Uh-oh. Oh, that's right, because I broke a box. 
I was like, what, what are they getting so bad about? You haven't traded with them long enough. Ah, I need... Oh. Now they're mad at somebody else. Alright, let's try this one more time. Item frames. Fix item frame. Item frame is fixed. There we go. Now we can't mess with it. I probably should have renamed it, but I can unfix it and do that again later. Alright. Now that's done. Because I've been kind of paranoid about knocking stuff off of there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get over it, guys. So I've been doing that, trying to trying to touch up a little bit in here. I'm going to add an outside wall at some point so that way it doesn't look as uh, bad on the outside. And I added some potion storage for the splash potions of fire resistance and the uh, regular potions of fire resistance that come through here. Uh, matter of fact, we probably got... Unless somebody's been through there. And uh, that's not automatic yet. Eventually, I wouldn't mind trying to find a way to automate that. But I'm not sure how that's going to work with the way I got things now. I got a little finishing station over here. So that way, if you want to turn some of these regular fire resistance into splash. Or if you want to add... Uh, it's redstone, right? That extends the duration. Arcadius? Yes... It's redstone that extends the duration on potions, right? Yes. Okay. So. Glowstone levels it up. Redstone increases duration. Is there a leveled up fire resistance? Or is it just straight up fire resistance? No. Fire resistance doesn't have a level up. Okay. So stocking this up with gunpowder and redstone is probably the best thing to do. Yeah. Not okay. that we don't Good. already produce enough. I mean... <laughs> I mean, we, we got some splash, but I, I wouldn't mind the ability to uh, increase the duration from three minutes to, what would it be, six or eight? Doubles, I believe. Okay, so that'd be six. Uh, here's the other question. I built two potion brewing stations from my Season Zero base over here as well. And uh, other than fire resistance, what do we need here in the nether? Well, your other ingredient that comes from the nether that is actually worth keeping, other than strength potions for your combat eccentric folk, is gas tears, and that's going to create your uh, rejuvenation potions. Okay. Um. Yeah, but what else would we what else would we need here in the nether? Um. Rejuve, rejuve, and will we want some health potions over here? Like that's what glistening melon, wouldn't it? Yeah, but honestly, if you've got rejuvenation, you don't really need the other. I would argue vice versa, uh, but I honestly I, think rejuvenation's better than <clears throat> straight health. I like the idea of rejuvenation, but usually by the time I remember to get a potion, I really need hearts like right now. So that tends to be my, uh, my my deal with that is uh, by the time I need hearts, I need them like yesterday. <laughs> and so waiting for rejuvenation to slowly tick them up is not an option. All right, so I'll, I'll make one of those a, um, a health and... I don't know. Well, uh, are we going to have a steady enough supply of gas tiers to set up a station for uh, rejuvenation? I mean, we could always build a gas farm while we're there. True, true. That, speaking of that. <laughs> speaking of, which that? Uh, one second. I have piggies dying all over my ears. Oh, oh, that's right, because you're up in the AFK part, aren't you? Yeah. I'm trying to help Medic get all the gold he needs. Um, 
What 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 is this all the gold one needs thing? Uh, he's building a sugar cane farm. He needs uh, powered tracks. Yeah. Um. <laughs> so I, I return to this. What is all? What what is the all the gold you'll need? I have no idea what that is. We're gonna. We're just gonna move right on. Um. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The Hi guys, what you selling? How you doing? The fact that we haven't actually built anything other than production equipment this season um, was brought to my attention and I was like, hmm, that's um that's fairly accurate. <laughs> I got I okay. got nothing against that. Um so with that being said we now have the ability to mass produce a ton of different stuff, except for trees. I'm supposed to say that because, well, yep. jab, jab. Um, yep, no, no, it's on the agenda. Mm -hmm. That uh, That's a bigger project. Uh, that's a bigger weekend project than I've had time to set aside. Uh, but it is okay. on the agenda. It is not forgotten. Uh-huh. Um, Tree project. That being said, it is not forgotten. <laughs> with that being said... Instead of spending, you know, the last half of the season building individual bases for each of us, why don't we do one massive group project, like a who's, giant who, amusement park, or... Who's, who said it's the last half of the season? Um, have you looked around? What? We're not done. <laughs> anyway... Getting back to the actual point. Um, so like a giant amusement park or a giant underground uh, adventure dungeon or something. Okay. I thought there would be a question in there. Well, that's kind of the question. I was wondering if you would be interested in doing that or not. Uh, I would love to do we some discuss large later. project like that. But yeah, we can discuss that more once we have like the full team around. To yeah, talk about. that that seems like a, a all hands kind of. Well, that's wow. the point. Is it would be an all hands? Where? But anyway, I digress. Um, what's the what's the plan for today, though? Uh, I was going to try to finish up those two brewing stations as soon as we figured out what we were going to put in there. And uh, and maybe maybe try to hide the redstone that's back there a little bit better too. But uh, I need. I guess I didn't have to buy the glistening melons from those guys, did I? <laughs> I'm sitting here okay. like, oh man, I, I gotta I gotta I gotta buy all these glistening melon things for the uh for the potion brewing. Nah, no, you don't. And, and then I, I realized I ran out of emeralds and I'm like, oh man, I need to hurry up and trade for some emeralds. Uh and what am I doing to go trade? I'm grabbing a bunch of melon slices. I could have just, you know, spent a couple hours at the gold farm and had all <laughs> the glistening melon I could ever dream of. That'd be the easy way out, and that's not how we do on this server. Apparently not. <laughs> oh, come on. There we go. Yeah, server. Uh, you want it done easy, and you want it done right the first time. <laughs> you're at the wrong stream. <laughs> hey, now I resemble that remark. <laughs> hey, hey, I'm, I'm right there with you. you. Do you remember my first iteration of the uh, witch farm? I mean, <laughs> I was hey, that, exactly... that witch farm's still going strong and working. So uh, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be too hard on that. I was talking about the first iteration, not its oh. current. 
let's let's not even talk about the spider farm. I think we all just walked away from that. Oh <laughs> yeah, well, that's 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 the farm we just to, don't talk about. It's over in the corner. To be fair, <laughs> spiders are a little bit more work than anything else. That yeah, that's true. I have been tempted to go back over there and just turn it into a kill, a kill. Yeah. Farm. So instead of yeah, because uh, as far as XP goes, the gold farm is going to outperform anything else we got. Uh, yeah. And I, I think down in the caves I found a skeleton spawner near the community center. You found that, dude. I would totally go to town on that for you. Uh, so uh, that might be uh, that might be a future project real quick, just for the bone meal. Exactly. Pump that up into one of our... Uh, I mean, farms or something. On the other hand, I could always just do a giant kelp farm, and that takes care of bone meal too. That's a yes. Now we're talking like flying machines and stuff. All we have to do for the no. others. No, you, you don't need flying around. machines for a kelp farm. That'd be for a sugarcane farm. Uh, which I, I I do recall we're about to have. Hmm? No? Yeah, not my job, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. uh, that'll be it for that. And... Put those guys away. Probably need to... You got some more redstone dust too. Yeah. Ah, I'm gonna need more. Uh, I'm gonna need more emeralds. <laughs> the the eternal struggle. More emeralds. I, I just went through like a. Clerics. Yeah, yeah. You've and got this all nice the farm here full of meat. <laughs> uh, it was full of meat. It's not anymore. Uh, that was nearly a full double box I just saw you open. What about the other side? <laughs> uh, no, no, no. It, you, you misunderstand. Um, all right, that's almost full. Uh, and then what? Redstone? All right, I just got to lock that in. Oh, you know what we need? Blaze powder. Because you know what brewing stands need to run? Blaze powder. Shall, shall we they go... Need... Hmm? Mm, let's see about that. Hold on. Why, do you have some blaze powder, or do you know of a convenient location? I'll take either one at this point. <laughs> well, honestly, after we nuked the nether, no, I don't know of a, a convenient location. <laughs> but before the nether got nuked, um... Badook. Ah, my brewing box. Good brewmaster should always have. Uh, I can set you up with 22. That's all I got. Uh... Well, I wouldn't mind finding more. Hmm. Well, we can go uh, fortress hunting if you want. Do you have anything planned for the day? <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> we, we can do some fortress hunting. Then uh, we'll have to see if we can find the nearest one. Because I do believe uh, Medic was thinking of putting together a blaze farm. More power to him. Those guys are mean. Yeah, they are mean. But the farms are awesome. Alright, and we're gonna go item frames fix. And item frame invisible. Glorious.
All right. So this takes care of the potions of health. Uh, what what are the odds that we're going to? Uh, should I plan on making a gas farm? We're not mass producing the potions, no. <laughs> well, no, that's the question. Uh, I, I'd set this up for gas tiers. <clears throat> uh, gas tiers, if I knew that we were... Uh, and plan to build the farm, if I knew that regen was something that we were going to want a ton of. I thought I had some gas tiers around here somewhere, too. Uh, they, they were hopefully donated while I was hunting down quartz. Or maybe I put them back in storage? I might have put them back in storage. Or... Are they in my valuables box? They could be in my wallet of importance. Nope. Oh, hush. Or serious. You guys are like Jubba when a UPS guy knocks on the door. <laughs> it's not the truth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are you getting ready to start trading? No, I was making myself a helmet <laughs> so I didn't get like jumped while I'm oh right <laughs> guess what I'm not wearing oh uh, yeah yeah that's right <laughs> oh I, I've uh, been collecting the soul speed three books from the trading farm and putting them over in the villager trading hall there's a shulker box in the back And the uh, Soul Speed 1 and Soul Speed 2, I've been taking over the grindstone for the XP and putting the books in the trading hall. Okay. Alright. Shall we off to find a fortress? Yeah. Looks that way. What you looking for? Have another item. Or just looking. Item frame on you? Uh, no, but if you'll grab some of that leather, uh, I got eight sticks. That That is kind of nice having that there. Eliza gave us leather. That's... Oh, yeah. I, I gotta tell you, the, the, the Piglin Trading Farm is amazing. Uh, this is the sort of thing that makes nether only games possible because you get a source of iron it's not as good as an iron farm but it's still a source of iron and you also get your water bottles for anything that you can't uh, anything that requires water since you know the nether torches and everything on you what torches would I need not torches uh <laughs> rockets sorry yeah yeah I got a bunch of rockets okay which direction you want uh where we go oh yeah 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 uh setting the respawn point that that might be smart there it is there we go respawn point set Oh yeah, I, I keep one of those in my shulker box. Um, did a guest take out a corner of that, or or? That looks like purposeful stairs to me. Okay. Uh, now just it looks like it. I don't know. Yeah. Uh there. Oh, let me let me get the. Hang on, before we go too far. Uh, slash trigger, C-H, T, 
toggle. That way we got the uh, coordinate set up. Or I, at least I do anyway. Makes it easier to follow directions. Let's, uh, let's head east. Because I seem to recall running across something when I was looking for the basalt delta. And I'm debating on whether I want to, uh, stop for every quartz patch. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Hey, hey, I need your tears. Oh, that was perfect. <laughs> salty, salty tears. Mm-hmm. Ow. I know I saw one. Oh. Oh, suicide magma cube. <laughs> did, did I take a screenshot of the coordinates? Oh, I'd have to have my screenshots, Andy. Here we go. Oh, you found one? Oh, wait. Uh, no, that's the Bastion. That's not a... Eh, wrong fortress. <laughs> <laughs> There's two kinds now. Your blaze powder's in another fortress, Mario. Yeah. Yeah. Don't, don't get me started on that. Now I'm wondering if that's what I was remembering running across. Well, that one's no, right no, 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 no. Uh, maybe. I, oh, here we go. Just a little bit further away. Oh, and was that a ghast or was that a blaze? All, all I heard was the explosion. Um. Oh, that was a guest. And this is an awfully small fortress because it consists of a hallway. Is there I would more? search around it. There is... might be more. Oh, no. There it is. There's more. Uh, 63 by 66 by negative 10. You'll figure it out from there. Yeah, I got it. Um, oh, we're going to have tons of magma cubes because this borders on that basalt delta. Oh, that reminds me. Pixel Rifts uh, posted a video I haven't had a chance to watch yet on building. A oh, hey, there's a spawner right there at the surface. Hi. Um, uh, of how to build a magma cube farm. In a basalt delta. And I'm trying to think, is there any... What would we need these little guys for anyway? Magmas? Magma cream? Yeah, uh, but I mean... What good's the... What good is the magma cream? Ow. Uh, magma cream makes both magma cubes if you put them in a two by two, but it also oh, makes on. your uh, fire resistance potions. Oh, 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 oh. Um. Oh, there's uh, there's two spawners in this area. They're close enough for a double spawner farm. Eat. Sweet for the uh, person who promised us a farm. <laughs> oh, I thought that was you. Nope. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. Come on, people. 
Maybe this is not the best place to do this. Who shot an arrow at me? Skeleton. There's no skeletons here. They're only on the uh, planes. Ooh. Unless one of these piglins is mad about something. No, skeletons uh, spawn in fortresses. Place to have. Oh, uh, and the nay nay skeletons. Oh, uh, the wither skeletons. Oh, oh no. Oh no no no. Is there three? I think there's three. Ow. Oh, slimes. Yep 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 yep. A proper farm would be good. You know what? I'm gonna stop playing around and I'm gonna grab a shield. Where'd the other guys come from? Was it up here? Or did they just spawn and wander in from somewhere? Ow, ow. You're coming here to farm these guys too. I think I've overshot you like three times. <laughs> oh. Uh, six of four by one oh nine. What's your height? I think that's my major issue. Uh, fifty three, fifty four. The place you told me I'm in like a oh frosty places. Uh, then you might be too high. Thinking so. Darkland till I get Because the to uh, we are the the fortress is in a basalt delta. Uh, okay, I found a bridge. Oh, oh, hey, give me your skull. Ah, dang it! Oh, there you are. Yeah, there's two mm -hmm. of them. Wither skulls. Come here. <laughs> I, I love how you don't even call them wither skeletons. Hey, future wither skulls. <laughs> Where's Rast? Not helping here, that's for sure. Well, I mean, I kind of figured that. Are you over by the other spawner? I'm um, down the hallway killing skulls. They were not polite enough to actually give it to me. It's sitting right oh. there on their shoulders, and they wouldn't let me have it. Well, I guess this would actually be a nice place to uh, to build one of those farms, too. Enough overlap here. Yeah. Kind of get a nice all-in-one. Oh, come on. Should have brought more food. Of course, here I am. Oh, hi. Oh, 
Oh, no, 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 no. Bad idea, bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. I didn't mean to hit you. Nope. I'll be right back. Eventually. I, I need to go stand by some people who aren't mad about an accidental uh, sword swipe. Oh, oh, they followed me. They followed me. Here they do that. Can I... Oh, hey, by the by, while I'm here, I need your tears. Oh, stop floating away from me. Oh, come on. Oh, no, 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 no. This is all sorts of bad. All sorts of bad. I'm so lost. Oh. Are they just going to be mad at me everywhere? Because I see a whole bunch of them sitting there kind of... running towards me. Like they're still mad. Do I need to leave the nether and come back? I thought they gave Maybe. up eventually. Okay. Got a wither skull. Nice. How many more do you need for uh, Rayest's plan? Hmm? 9,000. Oh, come on. Not only did I not get his skull, but now I got this guy. For a second. <laughs> now you see why uh, I, I don't do shooter games for games revisited. <laughs> oh, good. Yeah, you hear big and squishy up there. Oh! Hi, guys. Hi. You're, you're not still mad about your friend, right? We, we all agree that Fred was a jerk, and... Ooh, hey! Hey. Ah! How did I get stuck in fly mode? I can't fly when I want to flee, but uh, I sure can get stuck in fly mode when I really don't want to. Popped a, uh, a totem. That's great. Ooh. There were two giant squishies up here, and they were pushing me into the two blaze. 
That's, uh, that's less than fun. Less than I do. Yeah. Oh. Does it always spawn two? Or am I just that unlucky? It can spawn up to three at once. No, no, trust trust me. I am well aware that it can spawn up to three. Uh, the, the question was, uh, how unusual is it for it to spawn more than one? It almost always does uh, two or three. I've never seen it do just one. Okay. <laughs> I, I was beginning to feel like something personal was happening here. <laughs> it's always personal. All right. Seriously. Mr. Piggy doesn't get out the way. I might just have to endure the, uh, the angry mob. Oh, now there's more of them. Hi. I have an axe and I'm not afraid to use it. Alright, what trouble are you bringing my way now? Oh! Right next to me. Thank you for that. Oh, yeah. Um, I was going to say, I see an awful lot of light coming down that hallway. Need to get enough blocks to extend this roof here over the top of yeah. this thing. Oh, so that way they don't fly up and away. Oh, come on. Fine. Fine. Be like that. Come down here. Or do we take out some of the floors so they're more likely to fall down closer to us? <laughs> That's always an option. I've never done that way. Hi, Piggy. Are you mad? No? Good. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Got a stack in a bit. Oh! <laughs> oh, wait. No, no, no. Never mind. I don't want to do that. <laughs> I was about to put the blaze head I acquired on my head, and then I realized that's, that's where my gold helmet is. Um, that, that might... This might not be the time for those shenanigans. Oh, what are uh, you talking about? It's always time for those shenanigans. Oh, hi. How you doing? Oh, there, there's a couple more up there. Come on. Now, where did that come from? We got lit on fire. Oh, oh, there's a couple more up there. There we go. Hey, you don't stand in fire, man. <laughs> Did you ever play, uh... Wow, I mean, come on. Uh, not... Not as much as, uh... Some of my server mates. Any of us played as much as, uh... Some of them. <laughs> yeah, well... <laughs> Hi. Alright. <laughs> oh, that's neat. What? <laughs> Look what I found through the wall. Another wall? Oh. Oh, no, that. It was oh, already over the fortress? Okay. 
There we go. Alright, so here's the question. Uh, how, how many blaze rods have you picked up? And is that enough to run those three stations there for a while? Well, each powder is going to be enough to successfully run that station for... I want to say it's like 12 brewings or something. It's it's a quite a bit. Um, and you get two powders per rod. Yeah, so I got a... Uh, I have 48. I got a stack and a half. But we've got two in some between the two of us. So you think that's enough for a little while? Oh yeah, no. That, okay. We probably won't even finish using that by the time the, sur the season's done. <laughs> that's because, well, we just don't make that many potions. Well, that too. Alright, you remember which way was home? Compass for it. Ah! I, mean, I want to say we flew, uh, what? South? Or north? It was either north or west. West. So then we just need to head east. Alright? Nope. We need to go west. My compass oh. is pointing me west. <laughs> uh. Oh, there's the bastion. No, oh, no, 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 no. Uh. Oh, ah. Uh -huh. I landed on there. How'd that happen? Or some sort of flight team. Oh. Ah! Oh. Where does Tear go? Okay, I was like, I'm not wrong. It is around here somewhere, right? Back up to the brewing stand we go. <sighs> I still wouldn't mind figuring out where I put all those gas tiers I've collected, because I, I know I've collected a few. I thought I had left a few up here somewhere, but that's none. I mean, there is always the chance that I put them in storage. That is going to bother me. Get some more uh, redstone dust too. Hmm. Is there a way to get redstone in the Nether? Um, you know, I'm starting to think that that is where the hang-up is because you can pretty much survive here. All together now, except I think that's the one thing you're missing. Yeah. 
I don't even think anything out here drops it unless you happen to find it in oh. a chest, but I don't think it's on the loot table out here. Uh, you know. Unless there's a place that spawns witches in the nether, but I don't think there is. There isn't. Oh, here's the gas tiers I was looking for. All 11 of them. Yikes. The whole 11 of them. I put those in there. <laughs> oh, I, I thought I'd put them in there. <laughs> no, that's, that's where I dropped them when I got back. <laughs> I also put all the cream and uh, blaze rods I got yeah. in here. Yeah, I put all the cream. Uh, all three stations are now fully powered up. And uh, I just need to bring a bunch more redstone in here. I know, guys. Of course, before I declare victory, let me actually hit this thing and see if it works. Oh, there's three bottles. Here comes another wart. Uh, a watch potion never brews. And there's our glistering melon slice. And there goes our redstone. <laughs> Wait. Why, why is the redstone dust not going? Oh, because it's a potion of instant. Are you sure it's redstone dust? Uh, redstone dust isn't going to work for a potion of health, is it? No. Because you can't extend the duration of instant. You can only level that up. Oh. Here. I got those while we were at the fortress, too. <laughs> What? Glowstone? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, I've got... I've got a fair amount of that floating around, too. Just, you know, I'd already locked that works... That, uh... <laughs> stand at everything. Alright. Fine. <laughs> Don't you antagonize them. They have a hard life. Sure they do. They do. We kidnapped them from their home, stuffed them in a box, and forced them to what's eat gold. We? I mean, what do you mean? What's this we? I I didn't kidnap them. I am merely exploiting their current presence. I don't think that makes it better, though. I was about to say that that still means you showed them in the box and made them eat gold. I mean, that's. <laughs> I was paid with the promise of gold to kidnap them for you. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's uh, do this. Fortune up some glowstone. Fix. Oop. Rename this guy. It's going to be to the left. Yeah. All these levels I'm using renaming. I'm down to my last 155. I can loan you some. I'm sitting at uh, 257 right now, so. Oh. <laughs> Probably to help.
help if I remember to rename at least one of the glowstone for, uh... That's gonna be going to the right. Should, should I all, uh, Britishize this and make it glowstone dusts? <laughs> or will some... Did they add an S to the end of that? I, I don't think so, but I swear it seems like it's on everything else. Just check the maths. <laughs> I'll fix that later. My kingdom for an orderly inventory. They call. They'll they'll deliver it Tuesday. Well, I, it I I do kind of like that. Uh, fixing inventory problems is on the agenda. I I don't know if the bundles are going to be the answer for it, but I'm definitely willing to give it a chance and see how it evolves. Uh. Because I, I didn't quite catch it from the original presentation, but uh, bundles will still only let you hold up to 64 items. So you're still going to end up with a stack. The only difference is, is that you can make it a random stack of whatever. So if you've got two blue fl like right now, I've got five gunpowder, 41 nether brick, six bones, two rotten flesh, and nine ink sacks. I, I could put all that into a bundle. Yeah, you know that all that says to me is that we're now gonna have shulkers full of bundles. <laughs> and uh, you're still or, or is it gonna be bundles anything. full of shulkers? Can, please, can I bundle? Can I, can I, can I get bundles of shulkers? I can have bundles of shulkers, please. I mean that doesn't change the the big problem of no see that it just that makes it worse because <laughs> now you're going to have shulkers full of bundles with bundles full of shulkers. Yeah, no. If anything, we've just made the problem a whole lot worse. <laughs> well, if there's one skill I definitely possess, it's making problems worse. Don't don't agree to that one. I wasn't gonna say anything. Oh man, if only I had a place to top off my. Uh, I'll, I'll leave that for Reyes spectral to arrows. On. Have you seen how many spectral? We have. We now have more spectral arrows than we do actual arrows. It's kind of funny. That that, that that's more than kind of funny. I kind of wish there was a way to break them down for uh, for glowstone dust, but that's only because I'm looking at an empty dropper of glowstone dust. Oh, I see a rest on the horizon. Uh oh. How much uh, how much glowstone dust do I have in my lighting chest? Oh yeah, there we go. I don't have glowstone Did dust. Did I hear bundles of chokers? <laughs> uh, oh, of uh, all that, all that, all you heard was bundles of shulkers. Yep. At least she has a priority streak. Yep. <laughs> the, 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 this is where I asked, what, what would you expect? What else would you expect? What could you expect? A bundle bundles full of shulkers, shulkers with shulkers full of bundles. I, I heard you like shulkers. So mm -hmm. I, oh, no, you can't put shulkers in your shulkers. But you can bund bundles in your chokers. So what? Oh, the dark, mumble, green mumble, green dark green wool boxes. Dark green wool. Uh, I don't know. Unless it's something. Unless it's part of what medic's working on. Maybe. Where do I get redstone again? From the uh, from the clerics. Yeah, but I need something to trade. So where do I find it in the wild? Where, where, huh? Where do I find it in the wild? Where do you find redstone in the wild? In the ground. Yeah. Thank you. It's 
scattered here, there, and yon and through the ground. Um, I'm, I'm going to tell you, you're going to have a far easier time going to the uh, farmers and trading okay. all the melons and pumpkins you can for emeralds than you are finding any significant quantity of redstone in the ground. Okay. If you want it quick. I just need to take all the iron. Although, do we do we not have... Uh, I thought we had had a fair amount of redstone in storage. I mean, we have some, but are you saying I can use all of it? Oh, this is for the lights, isn't it? Oh, you don't answer that question. The, 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 just riddle me this, Batman. Is it for the lights? Yeah. <laughs> you, you need to go trade for that. I'm sorry. You need to trade for that. Why are you laughing? <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Oh, what? what is behind... Oh. oh. Door number one? There's a circle. Yeah. Medic's Ish. building a new farm. Object. Is it a wood farm? No. Seriously. Oh. I, I'm getting to that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting to that. I, I, I need I need an uneventful weekend. Do you remember what those were like? Because I sure don't. <laughs> no, you won't I forgot. You're probably at this rate. <laughs> yeah, I don't have a clue what those are. Sorry. Yeah. This weekend's Halloween prep. Weekend after that will be Halloween. Weekend after that is <laughs> Jibba's birthday. I'm just joking. Out. Every day is Jibba's birthday. Yeah, well, I mean, yeah, I was getting ready to say, you think so. Oh, you know, I meant to ask you earlier, what did you need that item frame for? Or did you put the helmet up somewhere that it can be readily, uh... You didn't notice, I'm not telling you. <laughs> Rast, are you going to be close enough to... Me. Are you going to be over, I'm going to be uh, in the trading hall. Okay. Church. All right, then I can uh, drop all this into... The ones in the church give you the redstone. Yes, but I have to get emeralds first. Oh. Yeah. Well, just come out to the uh, raid farm. It's got plenty of emeralds. Does it? No, I lied. We only have two so far. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I mean, it, it does generate emeralds, but I don't know that it generates that many emeralds. Wow, we are short on emeralds all of a sudden. That mm -hmm. turns around Five. quick. That turns around real quick. Like, here you are thinking, oh man, I got emeralds for days. And then you look and it's like, no, no, not, 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 After not, your station. not so much. Not so much. <laughs> Talk to your station. Yeah. <laughs> Talk to your station. It, it, it's it's after five o'clock. You're gonna have to see them tomorrow. <laughs> it's sangria o'clock. Come back tomorrow. <laughs> it's scotch o'clock. They're unkind. Nope. They just keep bankers hours with bankers punctuality. <laughs> In the middle of a transaction, and they close the window on you. Yeah, it, it feels like it. It sure does feel like it. I mean, I know that's not right, but that's also not wrong. <laughs> it really does, though. There we go. Oh, I forgot I have those traps up there. Never mind. <laughs> what traps up what where? What traps up where? The, the raid bar just refilled oh. itself for a new wave and half the bar yeah. went away and I'm like how is that happening oh, oh yeah mind. yeah yeah up. for the uh the, the ravager beasts yeah exactly the beasties release the beast feed, feed the, the beast. beast or something like that. oh man I'm gonna need to trade so much redstone 
my life is going to be nothing but redstone. Why do you need to some, trade redstone? Some idiot promised to light up all these lamps. <laughs> <laughs> Your words, not mine. <laughs> well, I mean... We have it on film. It was not my smartest moment, I will admit. Challenged her to do something. Well, I, 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 <laughs> in <laughs> retrospect, I really should have known better. I really, <laughs> really should have known better. <laughs> I, I, I don't know why I didn't know better, because I really should have known better. The sun's out. Talk to your station. It's not time. It's only eight o'clock. Go to work. Look, th there, look, ju just all those people that you don't like standing outside the door at, you know, two minutes to opening, staring pointedly at their watch. Yeah, but this is this is them, not her. <laughs> See that. <laughs> We gotta get her away from this city. <laughs> Rubbing off. Ah, <laughs> uh, all right. Double standard is real. All right, they they should be they should be willing to talk to you now. Oh, that's right. You're going with these guys for the uh, iron. Yep. Oh, uh, I don't know if you noticed, but um. And there's a new shulker box over here with Soul Sand. Wait a minute. Books, or Soul Speed books. There's your 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 pig death place has oh. rotten flesh. Yeah. Yes. How much rotten Pig's flesh? Death. Not place. much since I traded most of it the last go round. Uh, there's oh. a bunch of extra. <laughs> yeah, there, there's a bunch of extra shulker boxes that I used to haul it. There. there should be about a double chest and a half because I was up there AFK for a little while. Yeah, but they only, they trade them in stacks of like 31, 32. So each stack of rotten flesh is only two of the trades. Which, I mean, it, it lets you burn through your overstock really quick. It's just a pain to get any uh, meaningful amount of trading done. Not for lack of trying, What though. else will you give me emeralds for? Uh, you can go to the... If we were smart, we would have just made the church up there on the roof, too. <laughs> what do you mean? On what roof? The nether roof. The nether roof? That way we could have had the uh, <laughs> priest right there next to the... <laughs> Bless you, my piggy brethren. Here's an emerald. Instead of communion, you open your mouth and get a uh, emerald. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see if this works again now. That's how that works. There's our another wart. And while we're at it, let's make sure this works. All right. What else can I give you guys that leave me emeralds? What else do we have an unending supply of? Iron. <laughs> Don't Pumpkin. have that many guys. Yet. We'll get there. I give them paper, though. Ooh, how do you make paper? Uh, sugar cane. Don't we have a farm for that? We have a small farm for that. There's a bunch of back stock in the back. Where there was. I don't know if it got moved, though. Oh, ha! Uh-oh, you found the back stock. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's, there's no, no maybe, maybe about it. <laughs> <laughs> you found the back stock. And we're all set for the next go-round. 
Which and paper is just sugar cane, or is it sugar yep. cane and something else? Nope, just sugar cane, straight across. Cool. We don't need the sugar cane, right? Uh, depends. How much do you like rockets? Oh, It'll there's replenish. no potion of regen 2, is there? There is, but... Hmm. Yeah, I never... I, I never quite got into potion brewing like I probably should have. go through all the gold I gave him? Looks like it. Alright. Let's make paper. <laughs> Alright. Um, paper. <laughs> where did I put... There we go. If I were a quartz pillar, where would I have put myself? This is what I want. Redstone, a little bit of space. Yeah. So we got one, two, three, four, five spaces between here. One, two, three, four, five spaces. Bam. right that way, right? No, it's not. Um, now it is. Then this guy should be correct. This way. Yep. There we go. Two, three, four, five, six. Two, three, four, five, six. is a much slower trade. Yep, it is. But so at least it gives the, me something uh, to trade in the off hours. <laughs> what, while you're... While they're already done with all the iron trading they're gonna do? Mm-hmm. Oh, you don't trade paper? You suck. <laughs> yeah, not all of them do. It's also a problem trying to find bookshelves sometimes. Because not all of them want to do that either. Your dudes are kind of slackers. I don't know if you're aware of that. Yeah, well, you know, you, you take the best help you can find. I was listening to uh, yesterday's Daily Tech News show. Sarah Lane's got the week off, so they brought in an extra guest. Um, he runs a podcast for uh, chief information security officers. 
which apparently has adopted the ridiculous nickname of CISO. Because apparently that's how you pronounce C-I-S-O. Mm-hmm. Don't, don't get me started on that one. Someone should um, rename them. Huh? Yeah, somebody should Someone rename should them. Rename them. So, so somebody should take them aside and go, uh, I have something to tell you, and it's going to make you sad. Where did I put the chisel black? There we go. And some polished stairs. I'm going to need a lot of polished stairs. Anyway, um, one of the things that uh, the the got the the podcaster was talking about that I found very interesting is using he uses games on his podcast, uh, notably word games. Okay. Um, he uses sorry, games uh, to do what? Um, just to kind of get some of the points across. And it, it, it oh, reminded okay. me. It, it reminded me a lot of some of the training initiatives. And, and after the after the show, Tom was like, uh, "You know, I, I'm sorry in advance for all the hateful emails about uh, how games aren't appropriate for a podcast." And he goes, "No, no, no, no man." You don't have to apologize. It's a perfect way to explain things. Like, uh, what one of the games was, uh, he, he didn't play this one on today's show, but apparently on his podcast, he runs one called The Department of Yes. So, your as a participant, your role is to be the chief information security officer. And no matter how ridiculous the proposal brought to you, you have to answer yes, and then explain how you're going to roll it out. I, I thought that Ooh. felt a little too close to the the my real jobs that I've had. Um, <laughs> the game of life, yes. Yeah, but I, I like the idea of using something like that for for training and for getting the ideas across. Because one, one of the other ones that he did play with both Roger and Tom um, was, I forget the official thing that he called it, but the idea, the, the basic idea was you're presented with a scenario and you have two options. You have to pick the least bad option because in his estimation that, that was pretty much uh, your, your job as a chief information security officer was you're going to be presented with stuff and your only real option is going to be to pick the least bad uh may the odds ever be in your favor well i mean not entirely wrong yeah yeah i i couldn't exactly hate on that one either um so like one one of the one of the examples was your ceo is on a business trip in china and the phone screen breaks. She really does not want to go the entire day uh, without having access to some form of communications. Uh, so, do you, A, tell her, sorry, but you're going to have to do without or B, uh, find a local dealer that you can uh, get a replacement. And then just deal with trying to clean up all the security vulnerabilities afterwards. Give me the scenario one more time. So your CEO is in China. Mm -hmm. Phone screen breaks. Do you get it fixed in China and deal with the potential security vulnerabilities when she comes back? Or, ah, that's the part that I was missing. Or tell her no and uh, deal with an angry CEO.
Those are the only options. Those are the only options. Remember, you're a chief information security officer. There are no good options. There's just the options you have. The phone screen breaks, but the phone is not compromised. The phone is not like broken. It's just the screen. You can't do anything on the screen. This is not like the cracked screen that you lived with for some number of. Uh, I I won't embarrass you with how long. Uh, this I, is not embarrassing when, to me. I'm frugal. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, th this is you're not going to be able to work on the phone broke. So your only uh -oh. two options are replace and deal with an angry CEO. No, you mean don't replace and deal with an angry CEO. Or, sorry, or yeah, replace. don't replace and deal with an angry CEO, or replace and deal with a security security vulnerability. I'm like leaning towards nice. replace. Why? Have you met an angry CEO, the person who cuts your paycheck? Uh, yes, I have met angry CEOs before. <laughs> Why ever would you ask? So there's that. And also, if they're on a business trip, what business are they really going to be able to conduct without a phone? Okay. What about you, Arcadius? Would you oh. rather uh, stay secure or happy CEO, happy life? I mean, it's not the same rhyme, but it's close enough that you you might as well just you know. No, I'm, I've already made my choice, and I'm not replacing a compromised phone. And a CEO of my company should understand that, because well, you well, can't obviously be the CEO you don't work for the company, company I that has. <laughs> you can't be the CEO of a company that has no more, you know stuff to sell so if you want to jeopardize our livelihood by getting yourself a compromised phone which could be anywhere from 12 hours or you know several days before it gets to us where we can fix it and make sure it's secure yeah no i'm <laughs> not entirely sure you need to be the ceo anymore i wouldn't go that far uh but here <laughs> here's the fun part um, Roger answer. Roger is the uh, show's producer the guy running the soundboard and doing all the back of the scene type stuff and Roger's answer was to replace the phone Tom was to go without the phone and the host said that the end result really should have been replace the phone. Really? Mm -hmm. Because Moses, at the uh, end of the day, you still need to do business. Your company's not making money if you're not doing business. So the, the, the end goal is to, uh, if, if you want people to not ignore what you have to say, then you have to make business sense yeah. when you're making your recommendations and all that. That's the end of the, that's the end of the walk. End of the line. End of the Talking line. to their station. <laughs> it's after five. They're done talking to their station. Mm, and I don't like them. Uh, so how about this one? You are the chief information security officer. You have a server that is showing all the signs of being compromised. Uh, you've talked to law enforcement and you are compromised. Somebody is using your servers to crack passwords and they're 
struggling to get a warrant to deal with the uh, the issues at hand. So do you pull the plug, which will limit law enforcement's ability to do something, or do you um, or do you wait for law enforcement? And just realize that uh, one of the passwords they cracked is to the state judiciary. This is also based on real events, this particular one. That's rough. Uh huh. Their, their server was compromised. And, um,. They either had to wait, knowing that the state judiciary was uh, compromised, or uh, pull the plug and try to limit the damage. Dang. That's rough. Mm-hmm. So what are you going to choose? What part of the state judiciary was compromised? (laughs) (laughs) I I love how that's the answer. Like, well, I mean, what part of the state judiciary that that nobody asked that question, so I don't I don't know. I feel like it's a fair question. No, no, that, that that could be a fair question. Like, I mean, there are some things that, you know, if something happens, it's, it's a loss, but it's a recoverable or a negligible loss. Versus, <laughs> you know, actually catching the people who, if they got in there once, can get in there again. There are other parts of those systems that, yeah, no, we got to... We got, mm-mm. But I also feel like this exact situation is also why a lot of people end up getting away with stuff. Because in order for law enforcement to help, you've got to allow things to come to completion. I, I still haven't heard a final answer. When you say state judiciary, is that just like <laughs> records? Like, no, I just want to get across. Like, fully, what do you mean? Like, are we talking like people this, stuff, this, this or is, are we talking this, like this is the this is the judicial branch of your state government? Go on, go ahead and ask it. What? This particular state government or like a state we care about or I was actually thinking a state that I mean it depends on the state like if some states are pretty loose on that stuff anyway so I feel like a breach is just more like an open form version of their natural state <laughs> wow <laughs> uh, that, that was not what he, <laughs> that, that was not mentioned yeah, because I don't want to say which state that's the case for. <laughs> uh, no, no, no. I, there's a he's got a link either in the show itself or uh, somewhere. So while it might not have been stated in the show in the show that I listened to, it, it has been stated and it's in the news, so it's not like it's a secret. Gotcha. Okay, did anyone ask how long it's going to take for Leos to be able to do what they need to do? You don't know. It could be six months, could be a year, could be three days. It it could be now, it could be an hour from now, You, you just, you don't know. 
if the Leos are allowed to do what they can do, what is my assurance that they will be able to catch these people and track down the data and all that good stuff? What are these assurances of which you speak? They have salespeople too. They have marketing. <laughs> you have no assurances. They're trying to do the best they I'm, can, but you have no assurances. I am leaning towards shut it down. Okay. Just because of the nature of the data, but on the other hand, th this is my war between myself. On the one hand, shut it down because that's some scary stuff. Yep. On the other hand, it's already out. The breach has happened. And I feel like catching the bad guys is a better way to control that. Then just shutting it down and going, oh, well, it happened. And now, well, nothing further can get compromised. We have no lead on where that data went. And I really would have to know how sensitive that data was to be able to answer that question. What about you, Arcadius? I'm going to go with option C, early retirement. <laughs> option C is not That's an option. That's not an option. It's always an option. Look at our society this day and age. <laughs> Look, th th this is not a movie. You can't throw your badge across the table and go, I quit. I'm not. I'm getting my $1 million you know, retirement bonus and I'm leaving. <laughs> nope, not an option. Ugh. Pull the plug or wait for law enforcement to get their warrants and things. Well, here's the question. Mm -hmm. How do we know that they don't already know they're compromised? Who? The bad judicial people. branch? Bad guys. No, the, the bad, bad guys. guys. How do Jinkies, they're on to us. I mean, how do we not oh. know that's in well, they're still on their active. That's a pretty good reason. Yeah. Bold, one of the two. Um, and how much harder is it if we pull the plug for the cops to do their job? Realistically, Unknown. we have the server data that proves it was done. Unknown. I'm honestly surprised there's not a law that governs this. <laughs> not my opinion. Um, what? You, the the ultimate fruit of your decision making? Yeah, like... Uh, I'm seriously curious why there's not a law that would, you know, prohibit me from uh, violating or, you know, blocking a investigation. Oh, oh, alright, I'm tracking now. Um... You know, I don't really know what the law would state as far as liability or whatnot. You mess up an investigation, that's your butt typically, so... I'm honestly curious if, you know, that wouldn't be an issue here. I would definitely be talking to my lawyer before I did anything... Uh. ...that notion. to your lawyer. Your lawyer said, mm, kind of messed over either way you go, so good luck with that. <laughs> Pretty much that's how I'm feeling. Yeah, well, right that now. sounds like, like a real lawyer, to be sure. Um... Yeah, I'm, I, I would probably not interrupt the police's investigation. Alright, so you were let it run and Reyes, what was yours again? I didn't give a concrete one. 
Um, because ah. there is many facets. Mm-hmm. Um, there always is. Not always, if you want easy usually. answers, you should do, do a different career. I think I'm going to agree and say let it ride just because I, I mean, it's already leaked. They, they're in there. They have it. And that is what actually happened. Uh, that is also what Tom said. Roger was of the pull the plug now for a reason. He was, his concern was liability. Um, imagine that the show's producer was worried about liability. Um, yeah, so, I get yeah. that. No, I totally get that. Are you kidding me? I'm not criticizing. Not that. But yeah, in the actual event, they let it ride and they were able to capture the criminals because they let it go. Which means they were at least able to figure out where the data data leaked to, what data they got to specifically, that kind of stuff. Uh, A fair amount of that kind of information, yes. So, here was the last question that the guest asked Tom and Roger. Uh, this is one of those ones where there's no no wrong answers, um, except for, you know, what the end results might actually end up causing for you. <clears throat> Who in your family would make the worst chief information security officer? I would like you to go first on this one. You who? I'm the one asking the questions. I'm not the one answering them. Uh, If we answered all the others, I feel like it's only fair. (laughs) (laughs) No, no, no. (laughs) No, I'm thinking this totally needs an answer. I'm sure it does. You go first. Uh, I believe, good sir, that you got voluntold for that wonderful privilege. And, and Why I do, trying I do, to fish I do. me? Huh? He's trying to fish me. Please stop. All right, Arcadius. Anyway, I'm waiting for your answer. Oh, no. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Nay, nay, good sir. I have an answer, but it's not coming out of these lips until I hear yours. <laughs> Ooh, would make the worst C I S O. Jubba would. Really? Hey, Tom answered with his dog. Except he figured the really? German Shepherd would be good at herding staff, so it would have to be the other, the Border Collie, that was the worst. Really? What, you think the Shepherd would be worse? I'm disappointed in you. Well, I mean... Although, to be fair, for... for... I think Jebba would do better at... <laughs> That's true, too. I mean, all he's going to do is look at you sad. He's going to look at the network usage report and then look at you all sad. It's not going to change anything. Which is different from everything else, how? Yeah, I was about to say, how is that different from a real one? I mean... And then in the after show, they got into a discussion about uh, board games. Was it a good discussion about board games? Yes, apparently. um, I forget. 
I forget which one Tom mentioned he played a lot. All, all I remember is immediately writing down that the guest uh, thought that Carcassonne was probably one of the best uh, board games to play. Hands down. Really? Yeah. Like ever? Hmm. Uh, he was a huge fan of it. And he, you know, it's kind of, ha- have you heard of this game called Carcassonne? It's a really good game. Like, <laughs> that's kind of funny. Well, I mean, I, I kind of get well, I guess that I have. a lot of people may not have heard about it. So, you know, I, I shouldn't, I shouldn't be too, too smug about it. Yeah. But also not every household is as avid gamers as we well, are. Well, I, I was, I was deeply considering, um, taking a, a picture of all the board games that we have and then mentioning that the rest are in storage. No. <laughs> oh, uh, except uh, the, the, the one thing that I, I definitely have to disagree with the guest on. He thought that Settlers of Catan um what was was kind of nice because it's designed to reduce tension and conflict. <laughs> yeah, I was I was like, eh, dude, you've never played with any of my He's friends and it family." Wrong. <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen, come 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 over to my place on game night. Uh, <laughs> that's not that's not how that works at all. <laughs> Let me tell you about some of the games of Settlers of Catan we've had. Some of them have been uh, a bit. Box for some wool. I ain't got no wool. You got a, you've got five wool spots. What do you mean you ain't got no wool? You just don't like my rocks. Next uh, you're gonna have to. You're gonna have to have more than just you know a rock if you catch what I'm saying. See, you see. Got wool coming out your ears, and you won't give me one. Yep. And then there's me going, no. <laughs> Why? Because you want it. Yeah, that that's the one that always, uh, because eh, he asked for it. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't get that. We we definitely there is. There is tension involved. <laughs> there it is. Okay. Yeah, no, I, I couldn't see the, the no tension. Uh, now Carcassonne, I well no no there there was definitely some uh, strife and tension in that one too. I wouldn't go so far to say strife. Oh oh yeah, Let, let's talk about river plots and then uh, and then try that one again. There were some firm opinions. Uh huh. Firm opinions. That's what we're gonna mm-hmm. call them. That's what we're going with. Firm opinions. Okay. Firm opinions. I don't know if I don't want to do that on that side. Um, okay. I have an inventory full of stuff and I have no idea what I want to do. You want to come work on Redstone? I usually do want to go work on redstone, but why, why in this particular case? Because oh, I'm almost done. With the roads? Yeah. Why, why am I feeling the urge to shout shenanigans? 
Okay. Welcome to it. snack. That's it. Oh, there are bees here. Bees don't attack if you don't bother them, right? That is correct. Um, harvesting honey and harvesting honeycomb counts as bothering them, though. Just in case that oh, needed I'm to be just said. Knocking down blocks, so. Hey, no, just, like uh, you know, co covering all the bases. I'm going to need more uh, like, how upset do they get, though? They will attack you, sting you, and then die. Oh. So they get pretty upset. They get pretty upset. They take it very personal. They take it very personal. They shouldn't. I don't mean it that way. Well, they're serious about their honey. Why, why are you asking about the bees, by the by? Uh, because I one found me. Oh. Or I found Did it. it. I'm not all? sure how to word that. No, it's just there. I just wasn't sure, like, how concerned I should be about that. Ah, gotcha. Eh, they're mostly harmless. I still got to do, um, I get a bunch of podcast feedback that I really need to do that, that I keep forgetting about until I'm sitting here like, oh yeah, it's the middle of the stream. I, I, should, <laughs> I really should, should be totally focusing on the stream, feedback. but I get a, huh? No, I, I should totally be posting feedback during the stream. Yeah, yeah. Well, no, no, for, for a lot of it, though, I want to record a video feedback. And that's part of oh, it cool. is just... Uh, I'm probably going to type it out just in case they'd rather use that. But... You know, like Tom and Brian on Cord Killers were talking about uh, the balkanization that's going on for uh, streaming video where it seems like everybody's uh, putting together their own little media silos and they're not sharing as much as they used to. So it, it's it's getting, you know, do you want to watch this? Uh, you're going to have to get Disney+. Plus. Do you want to watch this? Uh, no, you're going to need Hulu. But on the flip side, more of them are starting to offer free tiers that are ad-supported. Uh, CBS All Access has um, a free tier that is ad-supported. And oh, I did that wrong because I wasn't paying attention. And uh, somebody else was doing that too. I just don't remember who... And all I can think about is, you know, something like The Witcher, where I'd love to watch The Witcher, but uh, it's only available on Netflix. And in the past, what I used to do with stuff like that is I'd buy a season. And if it ended up being that I was spending more money on a season here or there, then I would have been on a... a uh, subscription for the service I'll switch over to the subscription but that's uh that's not really an option you can't buy season one of The Witcher you, you get a month of Netflix or you get a month of Netflix or uh you can try okay, to get a guys, month of guys, Netflix 
Where you at? In the town. Uh, did somebody trigger a raid in the town? No, the green kind of or bad guys. Or is it guys. a patrol? No, the green ones. Oh, the zombies? Nope. What does it say? The ones that ruin things. Creepers. Yes. Well, you, you didn't give me a whole lot of, you know, there. Th there, there's a lot of green guys that cause trouble. It ain't easy being green. Being green. Oh. Next to you, Arcadius. Arcadius. Ugh. Uh, is this from not sleeping through the night? Yes. And someone not listening as I was screaming about bad guys in the town. I can't hear over the dying Iron Men. <laughs> well, good luck fixing that. Uh oh. What broke? You don't want to know. I'm pretty sure I do want to know. Since Trust me. I'm highly likely to be the person fixing it. Trust me, you don't want to know. Uh, is our iron farm about to get relocated anyway? No. Why would it get relocated? Because uh, bits of it were relocated uh, by a random building inspector. Oh, in that regard, yes. Then it, it got a little bit relocated. Like, just the storage, or? Uh, just the storage. You're not lying to me, are you? No. Alright, let me finish Why would I lie about that? And I'll, um... Look, there's a reason why I'm reluctant to play Among Us with you. I don't know it would be why. So much fun. We would have for a some fun. of us, depending on who's the random, uh, you know. Are you saying that I am good at poker? I I am saying I'm saying nothing because that's probably my winning strategy. Is to You've sit there and legit say poker nothing. With me. No, we've just played uh, Who's the Thief and... Oh, um, I've missed that one. What, what, what's what's the one that we have in the cabinet now? Uh, that The Resistance. There we go. And actually Among well, yeah, Us does but... seem a little bit like a reskinned Resistance. Not that I'm complaining. That's fair. Uh, no, that's super but fair. It, it, it does feel very similar to that. That's totally fair. Although it was funny watching a uh, replay of Tango Tex, where he's playing with Impulse, B00, uh, Skizzleman, and a bunch of other people who I don't recognize. And uh, let, let's just say I would definitely love to play poker with Impulse. Oh, is he horrible? Yeah. You you can you can tell when he is uh, when he is one of the imposters because his rate and volume of speech noticeably changes. That's sad. Well, I don't know. It depends. Which side of this are you on? That's fair. I still want to see the one that uh, Impulse recorded with Green and the... In it, it's the in 
it's a bunch of the hermits. That's all that's on there are different hermits. That's awesome. Potentially. No, it's awesome. Trust me. I have a feeling. <laughs> uh-huh. I also have a feeling that Scar does not do well for some reason. Yeah, I don't I don't think he was in that one though. Uh, apparently, oh. though, the killer combination, Arcadius. pun intended, oh, was, was Etho and Green. That's fair. Arcadius, who do you or do you not want to play Among Us with while I BRB? Uh -oh. Hmm. still contemplating. Uh. All right, let me uh, step away from this one for a second. And let's get the stone in there. Brick. What about brick? Uh, muttering as my as I clean up my inventory a little bit. Oh, okay. sound of somebody's 8 o'clock alarm. That's adorable. Well, of course he's adorable. Is it just the boxes that went? Just the boxes. Oh. I mean, that's a pain, but that's not that bad. That reminds me, I can uh, fix this. I mean, technically that will never overflow, but... How much iron did we lose? None. None? Have we been through that much sadness. iron? No, I consolidated what I was picking up. Oh. Okay. I have two double chests of almost nothing but bricks. Nice. Nope. Nighty night. -night. 
Probably shouldn't use the respawn point at, uh, outside. Still gotta finish that roof, too. It's on my to-do list, as soon as I figure out how. I, I've been watching a bunch of different videos on building roofs, and not a one of them is, uh, helpful to my helpful. cause. Yeah, because they're all for smaller builds, like... A couple of designs that I've done would look fine on something, you know, a quarter of the size. And all the examples are for roofs that are a quarter of the size. And that is um, decidedly unhelpful. That's fair. Like, uh, where, where's, where's the, so you want to build a ginormous building? Although... There are some people who challenge the phrase ginormous with regards to that. I feel like we watch a lot of those people. Yeah, we do. We do. And, and I, I acknowledge that that's part of it, too, is that you know, the, the people I'm watching ha have literally... It is their day job to build those sorts of things. And you have a day job. So, and and I sadly, have a day it's job. not building those things yet. I have a day job. And a life. And hobbies. And I'm trying to do more than just Minecraft videos. Uh, not that there's something wrong with just Minecraft videos. I, I want to diversify. So I've got Games Revisited and Minecraft. I want to get some guitar building in as well and maybe produce videos on that. Oh, that's one of the things that I really need to remember to do this weekend is record a sound demo of my Flying V because I want to put that up for auction if uh, Reverb supports auctions. If not, put it up for sale on Reverb because I want to use the money to buy a kit and build another kit. But all I'm cool. going to do is turn it around and sell that kit. Use that money to buy another one, turn it around and sell it, and rinse repeat. Awesome. And then once I've gotten good enough at kits, I I would like to then uh, go ahead and start uh, buying planks and starting from there. Cool. And maybe record some of the videos of that. And that does a couple of blanks. He'll start buying trees and. No, no. I, I am not. I am not carving it from the tree itself. That that's not on the. That's not on the table. It might become a table, but that's not on the table. Of course, it's not on the table. It's on the workbench. Yeah, I've noticed most of those guys have custom-built workbenches, too. I wouldn't mind custom-building a desk that's got a little more space on it. Whoa! Hello! Whoa. Why are you here? What? What's wrong with a custom-built desk? No, or are you there's about a something hole else? in the ground. Yeah, I'm talking about the hole Eliza. in the ground. Eliza? Uh, I believe we papered over a few holes here and there. Uh, we very clearly did. Yeah. Yeah, uh, fully 50% of the server is perfectly fine with just papering over holes. Not this 50%. Or yeah, <laughs> not this 25%, rather. Yeah, well... Uh, I, I'm coming around to the idea in certain certain situations, like the mountain that I never finished in season zero. I, I can see where we're being a little more flexible in uh, just you know building the mountain, a hollow, a sad a hollow shell. A couple of torches here, a couple of torches over there. It's perfectly fine. Eh, carpet. We had a wool farm. Actually, no, I don't think we did have a wool farm in Season Zero. I don't 
remember us having, but that seems like a lot longer ago than it was because then the uh, COVID happened. Because January seems a lot longer than it was. I don't know if anyone's aware, but this this thing happened where the universe kind of exploded a little bit on everyone's face. Wait, <laughs> where the world went crazy, or? Still gotta find out where the random drops are coming from on the farm. Because every now and again, I'm finding... a random bit of gold or something that fell out of the farm. But I don't... I don't see where that could be happening. I mean, obviously it is because, you know, I'm picking it up here off the roof. I'm also running out of slabs. Oh! Well, since I'm here... Are you on your roof? I I was on the roof. Is that uh, the indication that you are no longer on the roof? Uh, I am back on the roof once again. Uh, let's just, you know, something something Minecraft workman's comp. Is that a thing? Is that how that works? Can it be? I don't think so. You don't think so? I don't think so. No? We're going to go with no, that's not a thing. So you're not going to send me a, a reduced portion of golden carrots for uh, my no. inability to climb back up on the roof? carrots for you. <laughs> what about pie? No. No? Oh. Sorry. You want pie My brain made a weird jump and all of a sudden I realized that we have carrots in the game and we have cake in the game. Why do we not have carrot cake in the game? We don't have cream cheese. Just shake the cow up a little more. Okay, you make a redstone machine that shakes the cow. Okay. I will remember that you said that. And and I will make a redstone machine that shakes the cow. Awesome. Uh, how vigorously does this cow need to be shook? Is there shaking I mean, cow syndrome? have you ever like, tried making... It, it, it's going to be some vigorous shaking. Okay, like, vigorous. You ever done a shake okay. and bake? Okay. Alright, so it, just, it needs to be vigorous. Gotcha. Alright, I will figure out how to vigorously shake vigorous. the cow. Define substantial. I mean, I tried to get definitions earlier when you were asking questions, and you saw how well that worked for me, so good luck. Uh, well, you were asking questions I didn't have an answer to, because they were not included in the show, because nobody else asked those questions. I'm not sure well, who so that I reflects on. I thought was creative enough to ask. How is that my problem? So when are you planning on becoming a Chief Information Security Officer? <laughs> Never. Thank you very much. No? No. No, you don't want that job? A, I don't know enough about that stuff. B, uh, no. Neither do some of the other ones I've worked with. You'll be fine. Actually, you'll be better. No. 
No. Why? Because I'll do research? Yeah, yeah, because you'll do that thing called keeping up in your field. It's strange They're how sort it of keeps really coming back around out that. when, yeah, people tell me, like, I ask them questions about, you know, status of things in their field, and I get told, oh, yeah, I don't, like, do that. It's like, but... Yeah, but it's your job. But, but how do you... Huh? Yeah. Is that the right level? That is apparently the correct level. Nice. Oh, come on. One just came in and dropped a pig and left. Hmm? Wait, who just came in and dropped a pig? A certain puppy. Oh. Oh, okay. I gotcha. Came in, tossed a pig, left. And left? Yeah. Like, I think it's because okay, someone offered a UT. Uh, Someone offered OUT, so all of a sudden my importance in life went significantly less. Yeah, well, you know, we're, we're all we're all gauged in value of our reposable thumbs. Yes. But he is cute, though. should stop, but I, I, I've almost got this roof done. I still need to figure out the walls. I still need to figure out how I'm going to do that, but um, I'm not going to make this big or grand. I mean, it's a little trading hall on the roof of the nether. This does not need to be a mansion. I, I really want it to look like a, a literal, you know, nowhere station. If I had to remember to bring more fuel, I could have at least made a little more cracked stone, but... Eh. Beggars and choosers and all that. Only there are people on the server that could bring you things. Yeah, well, you know, that, that would require thinking about it before you place a few stacks of stuff and... Probably should have AFK'd for more gold so I can keep these guys trading while I'm here. I do, I do still need to figure out uh, a way to handle the the, <laughs> the poor throughput and get a bigger uh, buffer. I think that's that might be the problem because one hopper. Are you gonna put walls on it? Yeah, I told okay. you that was one of the one of the things that was missing. I wanted to be sure. Uh, I wanted to focus on the roof since I was going to do a simple flat roof like I've done so many times before. Thanks, are angsty. But, um, yeah. Since one hopper is not enough to get, the, to get the throughput for these guys, I was thinking um, Replacing maybe this stone with another hopper going into that one? No, it's, it's not going to work going into that one. Oh, and I still need to figure out a door for access back here. Oh, no, I could do that. Let me take that out there. <clears throat> Angry pigs. As opposed to the angry birds. Uh, do I have two extra hoppers here? No. Do I want to find my redstone box or just make another hopper? I'm just going to make another hopper. 
I can't believe that's a question. That's hilarious. What? Do what? I want to find my redstone box or just make another hopper? Oh, because, you know, hoppers are going to be... Yeah, yeah we'll, we'll just, we just won't need another hopper, will we? Extras will we'll just sit there languishing, going to waste. How many hoppers do we have in here? Not many. We have eight. I've already pillaged. Huh? We have eight. You have eight? Mm hmm. See, I Which think... two pairs more than I was expecting? Yeah. I think if I can get a hopper minecart to sit a astride both this guy and the center hopper, I might be able to pick up uh, more items that way. But uh, that might just have to be a, a thing for another day. <laughs> if you bone meal right. dirt will grass grow uh no oh. you need to you need to actually bone meal grass Come on. If you bone meal dirt, will grass grow? Because I want to know. Well, well, I mean, I get questions. that you want to know. I was trying to figure out why you want to know. Like, I feel like that is a personal question. <laughs> Alright. We have a roof, and it is spawn proof. That is the important part. Ah, I wonder what... Uh, oh, that's right. That, uh, that's why I didn't look up the plans. Because we need... Uh, we need wither roses. If only somebody had finished a wither rose farm. I mean, somebody would need wood from the tree farm. I, I thought you already had everything you needed for that one. I mean, other than the wither. I mean... Well... He is moderately important to that. I mean, it's in the name and everything. Come the walrus said to talk many things. No, just thinking. Didn't do that, it hurts. Uh, this late? Uh, <laughs> after after being up for, for work as early and going through uh through all yeah, yeah, no, that trying to figure out what I gotta do to get a minecart to cover both hoppers. that would give me 10 slots worth of buffer moving twice as fast until we hit the next choke point. So, do I really want to stop that there? Or do I want to run a second hopper line into here? That's a wonderful question. Yeah, I need my redstone box. Oh, God. Because I want to finish this thought before it escapes. Although, if you ever find where they escape to, 
please let me know. Yeah, yeah, I'll let you know as soon as I figure that one out. Alright, so that gets me a second line. I probably want to, uh, yeah, I figured that was lost. Alright, bye. I need, uh, probably put a, actually I could probably put a composter on top of that too. I need a few composters. Yeah, I'm not going to finish that tonight. Nope, 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 because that's a whole nother, that's a, that's a whole lot of extra work right there. Whole lot of nope. That's uh, a whole lot of not right now. Fair. It is work that will be done. Oh, seriously, guys, all because I broke a box near you. Let, let me find you a kick mm -hmm. bar. Or a gold bar. I know I said I was wrapping it up. I'm almost there. Good. Okay. This is a face of belief. Someone should sleep. Nah, highly overrated. Or so I've been told. Hey. And stairs. I had stairs around here somewhere. Almost made it to the honey farm on both sides. Oh, for your path? We're wondering. Yeah. Uh, half slabs. That's the other thing I was forgetting. us back here to turn off the f turn off by collecting the gold before it drops. Alright. At that point, where am I even bothered putting it off to the side like that? All awkward. Let's go like that right there. There we go. Alright. Now I just need a uh, Figure out how to squeeze a hopper minecart in there. Uh, rail. Doing that today, or are you doing that next week? Um. I really thought I was doing it next week. I promise you, I thought I was doing it next week. 
but I'm so close mm -hmm. to being done right here and now. That okay. because of the carpet. Who would have thought one carpet could be so much trouble? Arcadius, what do you think about the roadway so far? Hmm. It's looking good. Let's do this. Oh, they're so close to connecting. Uh, oh no. I... Well, that didn't go as planned. Sounds bad. Uh, just unintended consequences. Hmm. 
if I put that there. Um, does make that more challenging, doesn't it? Oh, I thought I had that fixed. All right. Um, there we go. That's the other way to get it done. This is where I say thank you for joining along. I hope you had fun. Uh, <laughs> got a little distracted there towards the end. Sorry about that. If you haven't already, do follow along on Twitch. That way you get notified when I go live. I stream this every almost every Tuesday at 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern, and on Fridays at 6 p.m., I live stream the recording sessions for Games Revisited. So if you've been watching that on YouTube and you want to actually participate in the chat and watch it live, you can get to know the future because you'll see all six episodes before they air. Then follow along on Twitch. If you'd rather want... Uh, watch this at your leisure. The live stream archives for this get posted to YouTube along with the episodes for Games Revisited. So uh, head on over to the YouTube link in the description below. Unless you're watching this later, then you've already seen it. And uh, hit subscribe on YouTube. That way you'll uh, get new episodes as they arrive, live stream archives and all that other fun stuff. And, uh, you know, do a little bell thingy to get notifications if that's your if that's your jam. And uh, last but not least, if you really like what you're seeing and you want to help out, um, then uh, head on over to live.anonjunior.com. That'll redirect you to my Streamlabs page where you can tip, donate, however you want to think about it. Uh, there's no preset amount because this is a straight up value for value proposition. So whatever you think it's worth, consider giving that back in value, even if it's just enough for another cup of coffee. Because uh, with a name like Coffee Craft, that's never wrong. <laughs> All right. Have fun.